hello and welcome to my channel please like share and subscribe if you like this video and thank you all so much for watching thank you thank you thank you to my day ones twos and threes thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in that means well thank you so very much i appreciate you all and welcome 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 this video is for entertainment and educational purposes only so everything is alleged some it's not and the fair act use is in my description box y'all so let's get to it y'all let's get to it sometimes y'all this is why i don't do a lot of you know just regular everyday most stories because um i get a headache from some black folks y'all i'm just be completely honest and i'm not trying to be racist but i get a headache just covering some of this stuff how just how stupid it is and that don't make no sense okay y'all so um this rapper right here um she's from texas and allegedly <clears throat> excuse me y'all allegedly y'all her name is scad the finest okay and as y'all can see in my comments in my title i said slash the dumbest because that's what she should have been named herself okay y'all so i guess before she came a rapper or she probably still is okay um she has been being a setup girl y'all she set up gas all the time Okay, now I know y'all probably have heard about some female in Texas, you know, um, rapper that just got, you know, hit up and, you know, y'all, she got hit in the face, okay, with a weapon. Okay, y'all, boom, boom. Okay, y'all. Um, the ops, you know, caught her lacking and, you know, hit up. This is what I'm hearing. Okay, y'all. But the thing of it is, she didn't pass or anything like that. As you can see, she's in the hospital. Um, word on the street that 10 months prior to her getting hit up, they're saying that she set somebody up and took their chain. And word on the street is, um, I guess that's the chain that she has on because she's dangling it all in, you know, their face while she's in the hospital healing from being hit in the face. And they said that if this would have been just went over a little bit to either side, she would be gone right now, y'all. Okay. She would be out of here. But it just so happened you know, she survived this, you know, attack. And she's on social media, clowning the ops, telling them all kind of stuff. You know, I bet it won't happen again. Um, try to get, she, she want all the smoke, basically. She's letting them know she wants all the smoke, y'all. And at the same time, I mean, you in the hospital? Do y'all remember B BTB Savage when he went in the hospital getting hit up and then he was in there talking stuff and then a couple a little bit later he's gone um this is what she's doing right now y'all she is trolling and this chain i guess they want their chain back that she helped line him up or whatever and this guy 10 months ago and she has this chain and she's dangling the chain all in the camera and she's talking mad stuff y'all this is why i don't be feeling sorry for people when i first heard this story and they were like you know um, she got hit in the face. I was like, I wonder what she did. That's the first thing that came to my mind because it's females out here that's worse than the guys. And ain't nothing worse than somebody pretending to like somebody and line them up so they can be robbed or harmed. I, you know, I look at that as complete just evilness. And if she has any fans out here that support her, um, they got it got to be something wrong with them too. I'm just going to be completely honest because if I was supporting somebody and they were out here doing the things that she's uh, allegedly out here doing, ain't no way in the world I would keep supporting somebody like this. Okay, y'all? And she's an up, up and coming rapper. So you mean to tell me you're out here setting up people and you don't think that this is going to affect your career? And I, I heard some of my music. It was, y'all... <laughs> Don't quit a day job. That's all I got to say. I heard some of her music. This is sad. This clout stuff out here, y'all, is so sad. And the women are worse than the guys, to be honest with y'all, when it comes to all the street mess, uh, when it comes to all this clout. This is what she posted. I don't know if it's Scav the, the Finest or The Finest, okay? Um, but it should be the dumbest. Like I said, this is what is on her, um, she posted. Took a face shot. 
feeling like 50 cent so and so and as i'm off bed rest i'm making a hit y'all she can't even write a sentence y'all <laughs> y'all she's she basically saying when she get off house arrest it's on she about to you know blow she act like she about to blow up off of this y'all people is so oopit stay girl do you know they coming back do you know they're gonna catch you they and do you know that they are coming back she is taunting them after she got hit in the face y'all this world we living in is so pathetic it doesn't make sense um this is what she puts up laugh out loud guess the freestyle i recorded 10 months ago got my shot got my instead of me i got my shot in the face two days ago okay and she's laughing she's laughing up laughing emojis who laughs when they get shot in the face y'all please tell me what's going on with our race these are and y'all wonder why people are not caring anymore y'all wonder why people don't care and that they're just letting y'all just you know take each other out and do you they tired of y'all they're seriously tired of y'all and y'all are making it very easy for people to take you out and, you know, um, everything, y'all. You know, instead of you being happy that you made it through some somebody coming at you in this way, you are out here taunting the guys that did it. She wants them to spin the block and come back. This is what she wants. This is what she's begging for. This is what she's asking for. She's basically telling them, I bet you won't do it again. I bet this won't happen again. <laughs> Lord, Lord, Lord. What is wrong with our people, y'all? Because I don't understand it. And I know, you know, I know I didn't grow up around street associates. I know there are females that are more hardcore than the guys are. But it just looks so bad, y'all. And at the same time, it looks so bad. You know, there's stories coming out that she was setting people up. You know, she would date guys and, you know, hang out with them. And then she would call and set up a play for her, you know, her little minions to come and, you know, um, set that person up. This is crazy. This is crazy, y'all. I don't understand it. What is wrong with our people? You go out with somebody and then you go and line them up. Ten months later, after you done line this person up to get robbed and all this stuff, you get hit in the face. And the only thing that you can say behind it is, you know, you about to make a hit song. And I bet you they won't do it again. This is this is what she's doing right now, y'all. Make this make sense. Anyway, y'all, I, I, I can't with this one. This one gave me a headache, to be honest with y'all. My head started hurting. Just off the stupidity of certain people. My head started pounding. I sit back and I think about, excuse me, Cardi B saying that she used to be a, you know, set up person that she would you know rob guys and they'll wake up and you know she'll give them some little, little something something you know to sip on and once they're knocked out she would rob them and leave them in the hotels this is carly b talking y'all and it makes you wonder you know who is this guy she talking about is they ever gonna come forth and say something about it because the more carly b grow, go up um she already admitted to the sin <laughs> y'all Y'all, y'all, this girl right here is dangling the, the, the charm in the camera, letting you know if you want it, come and get it. Because that's the only way you're going to, you know, get a chance of getting this back. If you, you know, come take it. This is basically what she's taunting them saying. And while she's laying up in the hospital bed, she's doing videos 
taunting the people that just came for you. And I'm going to tell you this. When they come that next time, they're going to make sure you're gone. They are going to make sure that you are gone completely. It's not going to be no chance of, you know, you the police coming to get you or something, something, something. It is going to be where they're going to take you out. Seriously. And um, they ain't going to think nothing of it. Nothing of it, y'all. I want y'all to think about Young Dolph. The 22 shots. I want y'all to think about that. It wasn't just about the number 22, y'all. It was about they tried other times before and Dolph pulled through. So this time is light him up. Empty the clip. Make sure he's gone. I don't want to hear another peep out of him ever again. Well, y'all ain't going to get your money. The ones that was paid for to do it, y'all. And this is what this female right here is asking for. She is asking for it to be taken out. And not, nobody ain't going to think nothing of it. But this time, due to the fact that she's taunting, um, they're going to make sure you're gone the next time. Y'all, this one right here is a little deep. This is a little deep, and it's probably going to be people, because people love messy stuff. People going to want to be anticipating to go back to see what she going to write about, and this and that and that and this. But if you ask me, and this is my personal opinion, she is a goner, y'all. She's a goner. I'm just saying. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Do y'all see, ladies, that when you have son, you know, you have son or sons, um, you got to teach them some sense, y'all. You got to teach them to do some homework on these, you know, these females out here that they messing with. Because it could cause them a world of, you know, um, trouble. Seriously, y'all. It could cause them a world of trouble. So, you got to be careful. You truly have to be careful. You have to teach your sons that's coming up in the dating game and out here dating people you know they gotta get to know people before they call themselves dating okay anybody that you know um would date her now outside of the industry um it would be their own stupid fault too if something went down it would be their own fault y'all because the signs is all over the place and people just are not listening y'all they're not listening this is why she could stand here before everybody and sit in her hospital bed and taunt somebody and say that, you know, she got hit up like 50 Cent. When rumors have it that 50 Cent didn't even get hit nine times. Word on the street, y'all. I don't know if it's true or not. But word on the street, he only got hit like four or five times. It wasn't nine. But he exaggerated the story for clout. So this is what she is calling herself finna do right now. She is about to, you know... It blew up off of her getting hit in the face. Y'all, I, y'all. Anyway, y'all, I got to go because I feel like I'm losing brain cells by talking about this female right now. I'm losing brain cells right now, y'all, and I can't lose my brain cells, okay? Anyway, y'all, let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Do you feel that um she's a um she's a goner? What's the name of that movie, Dead Man Walking? <laughs> y'all remember that? Um, This is what this seems like to me. I'm just saying. Anyway, y'all, let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.